put it in my YouTube buddies. Right, just a quick one for you. That's some years now I've been trying to um, get this winch working without having to use the control board, which is under there. Um, so I've now, I've just picked my fly sky up this afternoon, um, fly sky GT3B radio, uh, and I've had it hacked. Now, through getting it hacked, basically, you can go and you can set all your mixing ratios for four wheel steering, and you can set it if you've got dual ESCs running and things like that. Um, but you can also change um, your trim buttons into a channel. So I've managed to get me to turn my third channel into a, a, well, the th third channel trim button into a three position switch. So I can now hold that in and it'll inch out. If I let go of it and it centers itself, it goes into neutral. If I pull back on it, it winches back in. So, saves me having to stick my finger under there, so it'll look a lot better on the videos for you guys. Um, also, you bear with me one second just while it switch cars. Hello, back again, that was nice and quick, wasn't it? Right, uh, also, because I've now got this, this new function on my controller, shall we say, um, I can now set the dig up properly on the XR10. So now due to me having the XR10 with the dig on it, I can now, if I push the switch forward, it'll lock the rear axle up. So it just does the front. If I release the switch, I can let it go back into the centre. It then gives me four wheel, as you can see. And then if I pull back on the switch, it then allows the front end to stop and spin the back. So... I should be making some mega videos with this soon, um, climbing over stuff and planning on going over to Crosby Rock or Crosby Marina, which is a place near where I live, um, to go do some rock crawling, hopefully Jordan this week. Um, so I'll make sure I've got some footage of that for you. Um, if you want to know how to hack it or where the website is and stuff, the website's called Overkill RC. Um, they do the hack kit for it. For twenty, I think it's twenty five dollars, or you can buy a pre hacked controller for fifty dollars. Um, basically, your receivers are six pound each, so I think it'll be what probably. Well, I'm not too sure what it'll be in dollars, um, but they're not expensive. They're really cheap, to be honest with you. Um, but I'd say they're as good as a Spectrum. So, anyways, hope this helps you, and I hope you've enjoyed the update, and I'll see you soon once I've been out and got some more vid.